You know, I think I'm really proud of the group just because, I mean, it's, it's uh, they've proved today how resilient they are. Um, you know, we didn't start too well the, the game in the first 10 minutes. I thought we were um, trying to get with a speed of play against a very good team. And, um, but after the first 10 minutes, I think we were, we were more than in the game. And uh, we didn't just battle back, we actually created some great opportunities. And, and we'll learn from this. For me, for me it's, this, it, these are all opportunities to grow. And, and that's what it is. I mean, it's, it's building up to the Ivy League season. And uh, <clears throat> we'll, be, we'll definitely be battle tested by the time the non-conference is done. I mean, we're in a spell right now where we have you know, the next two games will be the fifth and sixth in 12 days. And out of the six games we've played, four of them are, are overtime. I mean, it's, we're right there. We just have to find, uh, learn how to win, you know, and, and turn some of these chances into goals. Yeah, you see, he's done fantastic. I mean, all you can ask of a keeper is, can you uh, stop shots? And can, in those moments, in games where you have to make a save, can you make them? And he, he did on, five or six occasions he came up huge and that's what you hope for and you can't you can't expect to win Ivy League titles or, or championships if you don't have a great keeper and so he's done, he's done really well not just in this game I thought you made some key saves uh, in Binghamton so I'm really proud of him and you know we started the game with uh, six freshmen because I mean Ryan got hurt very early we had six freshmen out there and uh, not just the freshmen but there's some really promising performances tonight.